on the Delali versus the business bash up. Delali, what's going on? Well, I'm a freelance makeup artist, and my bread and butter depends on attracting clients. Now, the majority of my clients come from um, referrals and social media. I promote my business on social media. Well, recently, I received fake negative reviews um, on a popular business review website, and um, I, these reviews have brought down my, my business rating. They've lowered it down, but I can't prove that they're fake, so the website won't take it down. Now, um, I'm pretty sure who it is. It's one of my competitors. Because ever since the situation has happened, her business rating has gone up. Um, so I just want to know if I can sue her for defamation of character. The concern that you have is you can't prove it was them. Right. What I would do is take a practical stance. Um, ask a few of your clients who do like your work, and I'm sure there are many, go ahead and put up something. You know, if you've liked my service, put something up there. If you have a couple of negative reviews and 30 good ones, everybody knows there are a couple of trolls in every room that are going to complain about something. And then you have the rest of the site and the rest of the reviews will reflect what really goes on uh, when you're taking care of someone's hair or makeup. Let me ask you a question. Did you do your own makeup? Yes. Because you're gorgeous. Thank you. So I think that speaks for itself. And then secondly, I know a lot of women that take that look you got right now because it because you made up, but you don't look made up. Now that's a cold makeup artist right there. What's the name of your business? Uh, makeup by Mr. Lolly. Makeup what? By Mr. Lolly. Makeup by who? Mr. Lolly. I just got you a commercial three times. On <laughs> Now tell that player hating heifer, bet she ain't been on the Steve Harvey. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, we got Carol versus seductive scammer. You won't believe what she's been through. We'll be right back, folks.